Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Trofin at the Babbling Belgian, and welcome back to Prey. We're still in the shuttle bay. We have a few quests in here, which is exactly what we're gonna work on today. But we need to do a few things. So there's a pod outside that we need to save the people in. I think the hatch is over there. And there's also the fact that there's no air in this area of the game for some reason. So that's exactly what we're going to try and fix today as well. So the mechanic pit is back over there. We started the game, well, the area over there as well. I think we checked out most of these areas uh, in the previous episode. Because uh, this is also the area where the people actually came into the station. So if you check over here, we actually have basically the lobby of... Talos 1, where people would come in if they entered the station for the very first time. I actually don't know. Yeah, that goes back to the lobby. I wouldn't know where in the lobby, though. I could check that out, but I first want to save those people outside. Let's start with that. If I need to say one thing about this game, one bad thing about this game, is that the loading times are still atrociously bad. But the hatch is over there. So we now open up all the airlocks as well, which is nice. But let's give this a little boost and get ourselves towards that hatch. It seems to be a cestoid nest. Um, hi. Ow. That's all hitting me in the face, but... There's also a few over here. I should probably save my bullets. I have plenty of glue cannon stuff and it does the exact same thing. There we go. The glue cannon. Now, I know there was something I needed to do in the correct order. Uh, I'm just going to take out the cystoids from right here. Okay, so I just can't launch the pot that, ins that is inside here without opening up the hatch manually. Um, how do I do that though it doesn't seem to be a prompt of any sort so I'm guessing it's all about those locks here there we go so I can shoot that off and I can't seem to be seem to do anything other than that so if I just blow these all off okay so the shuttle bay escape pod hatch has been blown and that means we can now activate the manual escape pod launch. But do we want to do that? We still think that the guy inside there has some um, some creepy plans with Emanuela inside as well. But because we haven't heard her side yet, but let's head back inside. Okay, so now we're back inside. We can actually move through the shuttle bay again and rescue those guys. So back in the escape pod bay, we should be able to launch that pod. Um, so pod 2, let's launch pod 2. Warning, oxygen levels critical. Please seek a breathing apparatus immediately. Eight. Are we going to see this through the window? Five. Four. Three. Two, one. Launch. Thanks, Morgan. Means a lot to me that you did all that, despite Frank. I'm transmitting the location of something that could help. I couldn't get it off the station, but maybe it can help you. Are you supposed to be going to Earth? Bye. So we did hear Emanuela. And now find what Emanuela left you. The reward. Okay. Let's go check that out. So it's down in the shuttle bay. And... Uh, oh. It's higher up than that. How the hell do I get there? Yeah, okay. I have no idea how to get there. Um, so it's supposedly just up there, but... There's no way to access that floor if I just look at it. You know what? Let's head back up. I know there's another level above this. I mean, there's an entire level above that. I don't think I ever went over there to the control tower. 
So there we go. Take this elevator up. Warning. Oxygen levels we critical. definitely haven't Please been here yet. Apparatus immediately. So let's just crouch. Because there will definitely be creatures here that we haven't killed yet. Um, what's all of this? Maya Bear Fleet Chief. Okay, no jump scare. Because this game is all about the jump scares, right? All about the jump scares. Throwing shit in my face. There we go! God damn it. Why isn't the psychoscope detecting that anymore? That was a normal mimic. I did this. For fuck's sake. Ow! You dick! Come on. <laughs> oh, and that was all my health. There we go. Ate a bunch of stuff. Don't really care about that anymore because I feel like we're... I, I mean, I said this a lot already, but I feel like we're getting really close to the end of the game. I just want to finish up the final areas before we head any further. And there we go. Hack the keypad, and that opens up the safe with a null wave transmitter and two more neuro molds. Let's reload this bad boy. I do hate that the noise is gone, because that makes it a little bit harder to detect, like mimic ticking and stuff like that. I mean, this is definitely going to be a mimic, right? It's gonna be one in here. Come on. Come on. Okay, no then. No then. But then the control tower. This might help us fix everything. Or it might be the house of a giant monster. Flight control. What's what's this hiding? Nothing? Okay. So this would be ideal to put a poltergeist, I feel like. Hello? Just gonna use the psychoscope to quickly check because this woman died. I don't know what she died from, but she definitely died. Volunteer flight schedule, nothing that interesting, I think. Then we have another neuro mod. The flight log from Scott Parker. So that's the thing, we saw that before, right? About that secondary ship. And then the transcribe of Maya Bayer. Let's listen to that. Neil, this is Maya then, I suppose. Bot. Can you get to us? No. We cut the power to the lifts to keep those damn things from getting up to the control room. Well, well we're, we're all stuck here anyway. We can't get these pods open. I don't understand. I'll keep spamming the security computers with help requests. Maybe someone will notice eventually. Yeah, maybe. So according to the trophies, that was the final transcribe. Because that was a trophy I just got. Just getting the all the transcribes that's interesting so that definitely means because we also got the trophy for reading all the emails in the last episode so this is interesting uh we know alex actually sabotaged the shuttles Warning. what is this a formal systems checklist before shuttle is cleared for the party extend jetway oh oh god that was not what i wanted to do but i'm outside here anyway Okay. I forgot that the windows were out. What is this? This is some... And... Where does this even lead to? It's a catwalk of some sort, but... That doesn't really help us now, does it? And my reward is still in the wall there somewhere. Let's go back up. So I'm assuming this is... Just a flight way that extends because of the... If that big thing opens, a shuttle comes in, then people will probably be able to use the catwalk to go inside of the station. Which makes sense, and then that leads into the lobby. Okay, but what's the reason for me to open that up? Because if the game allows me to open that up... What the hell is this, by the way? Just a closed off balcony. But that still doesn't fix the the air. Is there a breach maybe? I know there's also this plant stuff. Oh wait. I'd actually just whack this. Warning. No, definitely Oxygen not one. But we can go through here. Immediately. This gets us inside of the well, the vents. I don't trust this. Wow, there's like Cocktail glasses here. Somebody was drinking. Blasphemous. 
We still need our reward as well. And I'm not leaving until I get that. Okay. This gets us over here. I don't know if this is... This is an area we've been to. That's the elevator. Okay. New remote and wrench. Always nice. But this keeps going. Okay. At least this is something new. We're above the lobby now. And going over here doesn't yield any new results. But... This pipe also goes this way. And that doesn't do anything for me either. Okay. So the reward is right underneath me here. Oh god! Immediately. I forgot, I thought I had every every area yet already. Just die, I'm just gonna use the shotgun for all of this. Okay, hi, I haven't been here yet. Apparently. Eddie Vols. And he also has a tra- He also has a transcribe. Oh god. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Yu, this is Eddie Voss. I work down in cargo. The fact is, we've been stealing from you, sir. It started small, just, uh, moving harmless contraband on and off the station. Pharma's food not on the safe list. Well, I don't know, maybe you don't pay your tax and hardware enough, but, uh... Lily got ambitious after a while. Started stealing neuromods, fabrication plans, selling them to Transtar rivals. Yeah, sit on that for a sec, Mr. Yu. Kazma's got our IP now. Lily made me modify some of the old alarm panels around Talos so uh, <clears throat> we could uh, use them as dead drops. I'm certain a few of them still have company property. Three taps of the wrench will pop it open. Anyway. I just wanted to say, uh, <clears throat> I never meant for things to get out of hand. It just uh, took on a life of its own. But uh, I'd like to make it right any way I can. That's all. Okay, so that's what we already knew about the smuggling ring. I'm just going to check this one again because I don't know if the distance taps actually work. Because this is the only alarm panel in this room. I would have thought one of these would have it. But apparently not. I mean, the only way to get on the same level as the reward is this staircase, but it doesn't have a middle level. So, I have absolutely no idea how to get to that reward. Oh, there we go. I got it. There's a note here. Deliver ASAP to P.O. Box 1127 in Fresno, California. This is a medical emergency. Your payment has already been transferred and we are both at risk. Taking this off of the station, so please be discreet. I'm trusting you will do the right thing. Another note. Mama sent some special meds to help. Please follow the instructions carefully. I know you hate needles, but believe me, the neuromods can do miraculous things. I'll contact you soon, but remember not to mention any of this when communicating with me while on Talos. Love you, Emanuela. So this is also, by the way, that, that other note, the transcribe actually just told us that people were smuggling neuromods off the station so the the typhoon technically are already off the station which isn't good but yeah i don't know how to fix the air situation here you know what i need to go to the crew quarters eventually i just want to check out uh where we end up in the lobby if we go over there so through this door into the talos one lobby oh oh we're just here that okay so now i have general access so now i can technically do that okay we're just in the middle of the lobby now that kind of makes sense i'm gonna have to be careful because i feel like there's gonna be more than just one little typhoon around here. Because everything's exploded. I'm just gonna make my way around and quickly nip into our office. How the hell is there a mimic? I shot that before it hit me, by the way. How is there a mimic in front of the door? In front of the open door? Are you guys alive? Igwip, but. You knew what was in Psychotronics. What was going on in Psychotronics? Well, yes. They volunteered. Volunteers? They didn't agree to be killed. They live on, Miss Illusion. They all do. Their skills, their talents, their achievements. 
Yet now, they can do so much more. Much like parents passing along their experiences to their children. Are you serious? Have you ever... Do you even know what it means to have children, Iwe? Pardon me? What do you mean? I will do everything in my power to expose what you've done here. What you all did. Say another word, and I swear I will shoot you. Okay. I'd love to see that. Uh, why are you running? What is he doing? That was a bit weird. Let's talk to Makeda. Hello. Dio? Igwe? You okay? I hope you don't mind if I use your fabricator. I'd like to help. I don't know what Michaela's doing. I think she's pouting in the corner of the room there. But um, other than that, I'm yeah. just going to quickly use the recycling again. I also have like eight weapon kits. I'm just going to upgrade the golden guns for maximum accuracy. And range. There we go. Might as well upgrade the shot capacity once as well. And then the rest of the upgrades are going to go into... The glue gun, I think, yeah. Let's put it into the glue gun. There we go, maximize the range and upgraded the handling a bit. Then we have some neuromods left as well, about 15 of them. Then we'll go into stealth 3 so we can sprint without making noise. Which makes us pretty much, well, um, a, sprint, a, a sneaking gold. And then of course mobility 2, gain the ability to sprint with ludicrous speed and to jump incredibly high. That sounds like fun. There we go. Still have one left, but that's going to go into something else later on. There we go. There we go. That was nice. And it got a little hit there. But next up, crew quarters. We need to uh, enter the code for the adventure because now we've uh, finished that up. We might as well end that quest too. Okay, we do get a call. The data. I'll get it integrated into the fabrication plan for the new null wave device as fast as possible. And be careful. The Typhoon will begin to sense our intent to harm the coral. They're gonna come after you. I left something for you on my desk that should help. Well, uh, sorry Alex, but I'm gonna take a little uh, detour first. Yeah, I'm just gonna use the shotgun for all of this. I think there's one more Mimic over here. Because I made plenty of shotgun shells. That was double the reload noise. That was a bit weird, but here we go. This is it. Here we go. Let's... Ooh, what's this? Oh no, we, we checked that already. Uh, utilities. One, three, five, and six. I don't know if that's the correct order, but... One, three, five, six. Oh, that was it. Okay. Great. Transferring sweet loot. I don't know what I got. I have no idea what I just got. I finished the quest, but I have no idea what I just got from that. Um, well, well then, I, I suppose that's the end of that quest. There's nothing on my system here, but... Oh! Aha! In my plans, I got the plan for the Adventurer's Toolkit, a chipset crafted by Abigail Foy as a reward for those engaged in the treasure hunt. Okay. That means that we can go make that. So let's go check that out. I'm fine, right? There aren't any monsters crawling about. I'm fine. I know there's a fabricator upstairs. Or is that just a recycler? That might be just a recycler. That is just a recycler. So... No idea how to do anything other than that. Let's go back to the arboretum then, because I know where the fabricator is there. Because if you remember, the fabricator in the arboretum is actually... Right where we started this area, so not over here. Don't know how I feel like this place is gonna be crawling with enemies. This why do I need the sprinkler system? Wasn't that just to make those fancy tomatoes? You know what? I think I can now open this door. With a bit of force. And then down here we have the fabricator. Okay. 
Loud noises. Let's make the adventurous toolkit. Oh god! You dick! Okay. That thing was booby trapped. And I totally missed that. Okay, let's check that out. Your game master is proud of you as a reward you get the following increased recycler yield, increased wrench critical hit chance, a more efficient flashlight, and crawl through tight spaces more successfully, more quickly. Uh, that sounds great. So I removed the stamina regeneration for this. Because that sounds great. Okay, so that thing was booby trapped. That was nasty. I don't see one on here. So might as well recycle a bit. I don't have anything to recycle. Never mind. Okay, now. Plans for the next bit. I'm gonna make a hard save. Because I don't know what's gonna happen once we use that terminal. This might be the start of the end of the game. So I don't want to risk losing the opportunity to do the last few side quests we have left. But I feel like it's high time we actually move this along a bit. It's extremely quiet along here. Which is not something I would expect from our current situation. So let's just save that up. So it's saving. That's a hard save. Now let's go inside and use that terminal. Hello? Okay, for some reason there's more items here. Did I never pick up the Typhon Lear and the Neuromolds? No. I'm pretty sure I did. Because that's three more Neuromolds. And that's that. But let's use the utilities, I'm assuming, to upload the data. I don't know why it's making... S oh, great. Morgan. Transfer is holding. Something. Or someone. Shit. This is Commander Walter Dahl. The Transtar Board of Directors has authorized me to take full command of Talos One. Effective immediately. All employees must now report to the shuttle bay for evacuation. Those of you unable to comply, transmit an SOS and my team of rescue operators will locate you. Rescue One operators. Last thing. Alex and Morgan Yu have been relieved of their positions. Do not consent to their requests or assist them in any way. Dull out. Okay. Oh god. Um. I'm a sneak god. Kind of forgot about that, but yeah, they, they can't attack me. Good evening, Talos. This is Dinner awesome. Is in the cafeteria they haven't even... To 8 PM. So these guys have more Q-beam cells. That's great. There we go. Well locked out. It's Dahl. He already has his hooks into every major system aboard Talos 1. I have to admit I'm disappointed with our parents. And usually they had a contingency in place, but a small foolish part of me believed they wouldn't use him against their own flesh and blood. Regardless, we're not getting this coral data through until we do something about it. I don't like it, but you're gonna have to get into his command shuttle. See if you can locate his access point and cut him off. Hi. These guys are actually pretty sturdy. The Repo Man, access Dahl's command shuttle. Of course, in the shuttle bay. Um, which means Alex is hiding and hiding until Dahl and his tech officer are disabled. So that's Alex's escape pod. So we can still technically do that, but we know how that ends. So let's go down again. Morgan, Dahl will know you're coming. All Transtar personnel are outfitted with tracking bracelets. I have no doubt his operators are already on their way to rescue you. Those bracelets are issued and removed in deep storage. Worth investigating if you want to fly under the radar. Oh, definitely, definitely. I don't know how many of these things are actually... Ooh, there's definitely a few flying around. There's one over there. I can actually scan those too. Those are a different breed. There we go. Hello!
Wait, is that thing making more operators? Stop. Please. Stand clear of aperture. No. Please stop. Okay, so we need to go to deep storage, which is now also protected by a military operator. And there we go. Okay, I'm gonna need a lot more Q-beam cells, but deep storage first. Here we go. Let's go through all of this. We know what to do. Those military operators might actually take out the Typhon along the way as well. Might be nice. Here we go. Deep storage. It sounded like something was already detecting me, but... Morgan, I heard the announcement. No, no. I will not give you up. You are there for me. I am here for you. If you'd indulge me, I have a proposal that could get us off Talos 1 without any more bloodshed. Just... Don't harm Dahl until we've had a chance to speak in Oh, person. God! Hi! Oh, and there's a poltergeist around as well. Ow! Oh, no, that's an explosive! Oh, God, there's an operator there as well. Jesus. Okay, that was a start. Oh wait, I don't think the poltergeist, poltergeist isn't dead yet. Nope, now he is. Okay. Okay. Believe me, quite the opposite. Commander Dahl, on the other hand, has no intention of rescuing anything except the secrets aboard this station. You're all liabilities to the company now. Dahl, I'm sure you can hear me. I don't know what my... what the board told you, but you're out of your depth on this one. Call off your operators, or at least help us hold back the Typhon. We're on the verge of... Your brother, he likes a microphone. A spotlight. He can't resist, even though he's hiding. And you are running around like a nervous rat. I hear you, chewing the wires and shitting in the walls. Are you trying to fix the mess you've made, or just get away? I pride myself in being prepared for the worst. But this, this is truly a masterpiece. You should be proud. Well, well thank you, Mr. Dahl. Um, but I'm gonna disable my... Tracking bracelet, but what is my code? Zero nine one three apparently. Yes. Yes. I'm deactivating myself. And there we go. Deactivated. Ghosting doll complete, I'm assuming. Clever lab rat. Now I can't see you. You're oh god. Brother won't be so lucky. I'm closing in on him. There we go. Your brother won't be so lucky. I'm closing in on him. But with that done, I should probably take out those operators down there. Um, so there. Ooh, wow. There we go. Why are they keep spawning operators? No, stop. Oh man, thank God. I've just been going down the contact list hoping somebody would answer. I'm in trauma center. I came up here to look for supplies. I think I broke my arm when that blackout happened. Now I'm trapped. Aliens outside the door. I could really use some help, man. Okay, so help Luther Glass. That's a new objective, and he's in the Talos 1 lobby. Might as well go and do that too, because I probably need to pass through there to get back to... No, 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 no. Stop. Stop making that. Um. Hi. Stop. Stop. You can stop now. Thank you. Goodbye. 
So I thought I was blocking it by standing in front of it, but they're gonna keep spawning those, which means I can actually leave. So, oh, that sounds like a nightmare. I'm gonna leave him to the operators upstairs, but with that thought, I'm gonna take a little break. So thank you guys enormously for watching. Next up, we're gonna try and help loot the glass and actually disable um, Dahl's shuttle or something like that. I don't know what I'm gonna have to do there. Um, I'm hoping I'm not gonna have to kill him. Are you, I probably will have a non-lethal option, so we'll probably go for that. So thank you guys enormously for watching and see you guys next time on the next episode of Prey. Goodbye.